how to save outlook emails to your computer okay you can get automatically you can save automatically your outlook emails to my computer or you can get the uh, automatic backup your outlook email to your computer so i'm going to show you how you can do this so let's start with the video so guys before we start if you like this video hit the like button subscribe my channel and don't forget comments below okay so let me start with the video so i'm going to show you guys two methods that you can use and backup your email from outlook so first is you can simply export the PST file from your Outlook emails and you can backup it in your computer and you can use it whenever you want. Okay, so how you can backup? Go to the file, go to the open and export here, go to the import and export, click export to the file, type PST file here. So here you will get the all email ID or mailbox that you have. So this is data file, PST file I have backup and this is my three email ID I have. So I want to backup this email ID. I have to select this email ID and I have to click include on subfolder. Okay. So under this folder, under this email ID folder will backup. So just click on it. Just click on next now. So the, uh, your file will be saved here. You can change the location from here. So I just change the location for me I go to the documents I want to save here this file personal folder backup in documents so it is finished now you can uh, replace the duplicate with the item export allow the duplicate item to be created do not export duplicate you can select whatever you want and just finish you can uh, inter uh, you can also set the password but if you want to don't just click on ok then the, this file will be created it will be take some time yeah it is created now so how you can backup so you will see this backup file in this uh, this like folder it, this is offline folder okay so it is like archive or you can say PhD files which we have just added to my outlook account and we can just open my emails it is not offline it, you can say this is offline folder or particular mailbox okay so we just create the one PST file. So how can backup? How can get to the uh, floor? Go to the file. Go to the open export here. Open the file and go to the documents. Okay, where you have save? Uh, okay, I have save here. And just click on it and you can save. Open it. Okay. So you can see this file will be open here and it will take some time to open your file and you will get all your folders and email here okay so i have already uh, back, uh you know uh, open this phd file with another name so it is show here and you can see your file also show like this it is like offline as i told you so another option guys you can create the automatic backup of your old emails how you can do this go to the file go to the option go to the advance under the advance you can see the auto archive just click on archive okay you can run the auto archive every particular days you can select the days you, you will get the prompt before the auto archive you can click on it if you want uh, notification before auto archive during the auto archive delete the expire item email folder only email folder only expire items okay you, you, if you want to delete expire item you can cl click on it you can also <coughs> archive or delete the old items okay so during the auto archive you have to archive or delete the old items show the archive folder in the folder list and clear out the older than okay you can clear out the older than email so you have to select the months or year sorry only months so you can change the months here so you have to select the the data file okay you can you have to so by default this data file has been selected okay this archive PST file it is created in outlook file okay or you can also permanent delete the folder emails but if you want to backup you have to move this uh, email to the particular PST file so this is PST file I have to just browse it so here you will create this PST file but if you want to change the location you can change it and I am going to the new folder and here Arcal on 15th. Okay, so I just create this one. 
this file and just click on ok so this is auto archive has been done click on ok ok so now you will see this file here let me show you ok so this uh, auto archive will be run on uh, after 15 days so after 15 days you will see the this archive folder here uh, when you start the archive ok so uh, this that is how you can backup your auto emails in your computer i hope you like this video please subscribe and thank you for watching